Here is a quick tip when it comes to colorizing your tracks and your clips or events here in Studio One, something most people don't mention. So normally we would say click on a color tab here in a track and then choose a color or maybe right click a clip and then click and then choose a color. But what a lot of people don't mention is that you can actually just use your mouse scroll wheel to change colors. So if I just hover over this color tab, move my scroll wheel, you can see it's changing the color of my track. Same thing over here. If I right click, just hover over a color tab and it will change the color as I scroll the mouse wheel. And that works for anything where you see a, uh, a color tab. So color tab right here, I can scroll, change the color there. MIDI track, scroll, change the uh, color here. So that can be really quick, you know, much faster. Whenever you're setting up a new session, we need to switch the color of these things quickly. So just scroll your mouse scroll wheel over these a few times and get just the uh, color that you want without having to actually click into anything. Now, if you're wondering why my entire track here is colored, uh, that's a setting that you have to turn on. So choose your wrench and then come down here to visibility and make sure colorize track controls is turned on. If that's off, then the track controls will be gray. You'll still have your color tab right there, but the entire track there will be gray. So be sure to have that on if you want to uh, have the entire track colored. All right, you can do the same thing on the mixer tracks here, just scrolling on the color tab instead of having to try to come in here and change the color, just scroll, set up those colors real quick, real easy here in Studio One by using your mouse scroll wheel to change colors.